Hey guys, so this is just going to be a video of what's in my diaper bag. Uh, my nephew stays with us pretty regularly every other day for half a day. And then usually one week out of the month. Um, this month is actually going to be three weeks straight just based on his mom's work schedule because um, she is leaving the city and will be um, at some work conferences. So, yeah. This is, everyone packs differently. My sister and I definitely pack differently. But um, this is the Jujube Be All or something like that. Um, I do want the BFF for when our baby's born. And we have a different one um, for my niece. I don't remember the name. I'll probably just do a separate video when she's here. She'll be back Monday. Um, so I'll just do one then. This is what the diaper bag looks like. You open it and you can see it's full. Um, so yeah, let's go through everything. First off, just a little blanket. He does have a warm blanket um, with his car seat, but since it's winter, um, when we're going into somewhere, um, like we'll be at the mall today, picking up a few things and this is definitely better for inside the mall since he needs a little something but not really a big bulky blanket. Um, this is just a planet bat wise size medium I believe. Yeah. It's the wet bag we use. We absolutely love it. Um, so yeah. Next are the cloth diapers and this is Really what makes the diaper bag so bulky um, are the cloth diapers, I'll be perfectly honest. We have one apple cheek size one, and everything, including the diaper bag itself, is mine in here. Um, just because it's simpler than having to <laughs> unpack my sister's, pack it the way I want it, and then repack it the way she had it before um, she picks them up. Fuzzy bun size small, a blueberry size small, and he's four months old. And then a Happy Heinies one size. And all of these have the liner already in them, a disposable liner. That way, if he poos while we are out, um, I can just... Okay. Got the disposable liner already in it. That way, if he poos when we're out, I can just throw that away because I do not like a bunch of poo um, in the diaper bag. Even though Planet Wise is, excuse me, a very nice brand, an excellent brand, I still, after a few hours, to me, it does kind of smell a little bit, and I don't like that. Um, next, and I'll show you the diaper bag after it's empty, so you can see all the pockets and things like that better. Um, this is just a travel wipes case. We keep all of our one fly wipes in here, and these get wet right before we leave. We also have some disposable wipes, so his are really, because he is exclusively breastfed. Um, well, breast milk, but, you know, <laughs> she does leave it here, and then we put it in the bottles. Um, but it is still, like, really messy sometimes, so I will occasionally use these. We've only had to do it, I think, two or three times. I mean, this is still pretty full. So we don't use those at off, um, often at all, but we do have them. Um, these are two ply wipes. These are actually just ones I made. Um, I'll show you right quick. It's flannel on flannel, but it's like the really nice flannel. Um, and it's thick and, yeah, it's just it's adorable. But we do use these for poo. We just keep four. Um, I call it like rolled like sausages um, in a pocket. That way... They're not taking a whole bunch of room up a whole bunch of room in here because we can probably fit 20 of the single ply in here, but we can only fit like four or five of the double ply. So we just keep those in a pocket. We also have some CJ's butter. Um, this is in blueberry crumble. This is probably my most favorite scent. Um, it, it tastes, don't taste it. It smells like a blueberry muffin though, so I really like it. Next are some toys for when um, Jingen, he's not really big on toys. Nice thing, <laughs> oh jeez, totally cute. Um, and then a ducky. 
So he doesn't really play with a whole lot of other toys, but he does have like a detachable mirror toy on his car seat, and he'll play with that sometimes. Next part, and this may not be needed for your baby. However, he's a super messy baby. <laughs> so we keep three of these little like cheap baby washcloths. And even though he's a boy, I do have a pink one in here. I think I, those are like four for a dollar at Dollar Tree. So, just keep those in here. We have so many samples. Um, his mom gave us a bunch of samples. Everyone's gave us samples of like a uh, baby wash. <laughs> so, I just keep a sample in here at all times. And I'll use that and some water and a washcloth if he gets like really dirty. So, keep some boogie wipes. Usually I have more than this in here. Um, I just need to add more, but usually I keep three or four. Because um, this is, it's got like saline and it's better for wiping your nose. And then a little thing of lotion. And again, sample size. Um, Trusty, you will find ways to use all those samples. Um, if you're pregnant or have been pregnant and signed up for a baby registry, you know everybody and their mom will start like, sending you samples from all these different companies. It's kind of annoying, but at the same time, you get to try a lot of stuff. Two plain white bibs. I love plain white because it may sound horrible, but I can bleach them really easy in an OxyClean bleach, and they look brand spanking new rather than um, the really cutesy bibs <laughs> that you feed, you know, carrots or something in once and it's ruined. So I actually prefer plain white bibs. Next, and this is really just for emergencies, these are the Tommy Tippy um, pacifiers. I just keep them in the original thing they came in. He really only needs this, um, like he, he started teething, um, and he will need them occasionally now, but he's not really a big pacifier person, or baby. I do keep two in case one gets dirty. And then on the sides of this, on each side, I keep a bottle. Tell me, Tippy, we actually recently got these for our baby. It's the 9-ounce one, and it is the one to um, reduce like colic and things like that. It's, it's got the middle thing in it. I'm not sure if you can see that. Yeah. So, yeah, totally worth the investment, you guys. Um, this center pocket here. This has a little detachable uh, zippy thing. I just keep a change of clothes in there for him. So it's like a little mousse. Um, shirt and pants and then socks because he will be amazed at how messy babies can get. Keep that in there. Um, I keep it's so horrible. Keep some lip glosses and a lipstick. And I keep these little fruities from Weight Watchers because they're amazing when I get hungry. Um, and then I keep my wallet and some gum, and that's it. Um, that is everything that's in our diaper bag. You can see all the pockets. Um, this one I was talking about mesh. Looks kind of weird, but this thing holds a lot. Oh, and one other thing. Um, this right here, I'll use kind of as a burp rag. It's just one of those cheap gerbil calls. Um, however, I used... Um, cloth paint, cloth spray paint kind of thing, and turn them rainbow into really cute purple. This is the inside of the diaper bag. It's got pockets everywhere, literally everywhere. Uh, it's got two side pockets. This has like really awesome um, elastic here so that nothing will get messed up. It's got two places where you can put pictures. I've been lazy and haven't done that yet. And then it's got a pocket back here which holds the changing pad. And that is it. If you guys have any questions or anything like that, feel free to ask. Bye, guys.